so this is my compost from last year. I'm going to do a little experiment. I just had soil delivered, so I'm going to do a side-by-side -side and plant 50% in this mix with my perlite, and then 50% of the other seeds I'm going to plant in the new garden soil, also with the perlite. And we'll see how that goes. Yeah. That's my plan. So we just had this soil delivered. It's a garden blend. And it looks really good. Really good. And I'm so thankful we were able to get this. So thankful. Trying to do it as gentle as possible to not compress the soil. Who gets the fish? You snooze, you lose. Dad. It does, doesn't it? Yeah. So I cut it. Doing great! Doing great! Do I get a pizza party? No. No. I get one. Oh, you get one? <laughs> yeah. Well, actually, no, you get an ice cream party. Oh, okay. We worked at an ice cream party once. It was it was really fun. It was? Yeah. You're doing great, buddy. You're doing great. <laughs> now you really sound like a manager. <laughs> yeah, I know. You might want to chop that. You missed the spot. You missed the did spot. I? Yeah, you did.
so if you just get, because this is pretty level, okay. we'll level it up a little bit, but then if you just screw a couple screws in right here and okay. right there and call it good. Okay, cool. And that'll keep our gate from yeah. kind of crashing that way. Okay. So, like, what? Yeah. I know, I love it. Okay, honey. What would that take you? One minute? Hey. Cool. Thank you. So do I. I, get, I think I gotta get it bigger hinges though. Why? They'll work for like now, but I want to replace them. Well, look, looks pretty look good. How, yeah, I know, but look how bendy they are. The hinges. <laughs> I mean, this can do for now, I suppose. It's gonna, I don't know. For now, yeah. We're making a trip in. You gotta go do some library stuff. Yeah. This is what homeschool's all about. Yeah, but I'm starting to get hot. <laughs> yeah. um, violin? Because I had the worst teacher ever. Yeah. She wouldn't let me to go even to the bathroom. Yeah. Right. Well, now you got a new violin teacher. We're not doing violin. No, we'll probably do guitar. Guitar and ukulele. So you and Dad can, like, serenade me. <laughs> yeah, I think I want to block. Try to come up with a block over there, yeah. I don't know what to use though. I could go get those chicken plywood since we need to take those out anyways. Those well, partial pieces. Oh, that's a great idea. And then I'll just screw them up to that real quick. Okay. I'll, you know, you've got plenty of other stuff. I can probably go do that. Well, honey, like. Yep. Why? Why? We want a vacation, just in case we want a vacation. So this is the topsoil here. And 
Liliana is going to add the, a little bit of dolomite lime. There's uh, several different limes, and uh, we can mix them too if we want. So we, yeah, go ahead. And then I put the pour light in this, whatever it's called. Lime. Lime. And we only fill this thing halfway because we're still kind of trekking through the forest here. Oh my goodness! Let me get down from here. I don't want to fall. Oh baby! All right. Hi. Hi. This is better than FaceTime. We're going to be clearing some area today for the garden. We want to expand the garden by about 1,000 square feet so we can get about 10 to 20 more rows in. We want to get a much bigger garden going. Uh, we want to be able to eat fresh as much as possible from the garden, but we also want to be able to carry through that excess food through the winter. One of the things that we're going to be doing is clearing some of the brush out, Hopefully getting some stumps pulled, or at least cut down and buried. But today we're going to cut a bunch of trees down, the beetle kill trees. Our two primary objectives this year are the woodshed, getting the woodshed built and filled with wood and the garden. We want to be able to get most of our food, our produce out of the garden. That's going to take a few years, but we will get this woodshed done this summer. Hopefully we'll get it done in a couple of days. I'm not cutting things down with the chainsaw or cutting things up with the chainsaw right now. Uh, gas is pretty expensive. So I am currently doing things by hand. If we get into a little bit more of a time crunch, I'll fire up the chainsaws.
that's what uh, causes all the damage right there. I'm just sitting there happily eating.